ready or not, here I come, you can't hide. I'm gonna find you and take it slowly, ready or not, here I come, you can't hide. I'm gonna find you and make you want me, of course. Mr. Wonderful is back in the FC Sneaker Factory. And as you see, I'm always climbing up that mountain that we call YouTube. I'm always climbing up that mountain through all the fucking bullshit content that you see out there when it comes to the sneaker genre. I'm always trying to climb into the algorithm when it comes to YouTube. But like I said before, there's a lot of fucking phonies out there. A lot of piece of shit garbage content when it comes to the sneaker genre but as you can see <laughs> i'm always looking amazing in front of the camera unlike some of those other content creators out there and as you can see i'm no fucking phony when it comes to the sneaker game see i always try to look amazing i always try to look presentable presentable for you beautiful people out there the fellas oh oh and those beautiful ladies out there that I call my cheerleaders. Oh, and you see the beautiful lady on the thumbnail, Sasha Banks. Oh my God. Oh, my heart is jumping out of my body when it comes to that woman. Beautiful face, the beautiful body, and damn, she looks so fucking amazing on that thumbnail, I must say. Gorgeous. Sasha, like I always say to all those beautiful ladies, Hit me up in my DMs. I would love to hear from you. But like I was saying, I'm always presentable in front of the camera. I'm always looking amazing for you beautiful people, but also amazing for myself. Because that's just how I do it when it comes to this channel. You're always going to get the best of Mr. Wonderful. And I hope I get the best of you out there. Those beautiful ladies that I call my cheerleaders and the fellas out there definitely know I hope you are representing. So you see the packages, you know this is a Floyd's Pickups. You see, I'm always dressed accordingly. I am wearing that Yacht Masters, the more of that vintage kind of material when it comes to the black. I should say the vintage black when it comes to the color. The great hit in the back, I love that hit when it comes to this Rude tee. I'm wearing some nice gray rag and bone denim and it looks amazing on me. I am wearing that nice Look at that. G-Shock 6900. This is that Brooklyn Circus. I love this watch. One of the go-tos when it comes to like a black a black fit. When it comes to the, the outfit. I always try to have this great accessory. You see that? Pull that out. The LV monogram necklace. So, I mean, I got a beautiful date to go to in a little bit. But I wanted to drop some content. And, man, we are pretty damn close when it comes to Christmas. So, you know, like I always do. I mean, pretty much 365 days out of the year. I'm always blessing myself with some amazing gifts. But these ones right here, these specifically right here, are amazing gifts for myself. And I can't wait to unpackage them. A lot of these gifts right here for myself that I purchased for myself are items that I've just been, I couldn't wait to actually unbox. Some of these items, I must say, I'm not in a big hurry when it comes to these items. I'm kind of like, eh, I can wait. But these ones specifically, I can't wait to actually get in, get unboxed and get them in my head. But like I said before, though, at the very beginning of the intro, Mr. Wonderful is the real, the authentic, the one and only I am back in the fucking FC Sneaker Factory. And you know what? Just to give Scott Hall his tribute. Like I always break it down to you, especially in that intro. Hey, yo. Floyd Chavez here. As you can see, Mr. Wonderful is looking amazing. Back in the FC Sneaker Factory. I already gave you the fit breakdown. The hair. The skin. Look at that. Nice hair. The beautiful stylist always hooked it up but then the skin oh look at that amazing skin glowing as always just like how those beautiful ladies love it because you know what the beautiful ladies love that glowing skin because 
a lot of them I'm not gonna say all of them but a lot of them do have that nice glowing skin as well so they definitely always compliment me when it comes to my skin and how I look on in in person but also on camera I mean constantly getting the, the amazing compliments but we are like I said I hope you're having a great month of December hopefully you're getting all your Christmas shopping done because you know what I'm pretty much done and of course I gifted myself these items but I'm sure you're gonna once you see the first one you're already gonna know what how the ball is gonna be uh, falling when it comes to this specific Floyd's pickups but before we even get into any of that this is a Floyd's pickup video we are on YouTube and like I always mention, let's go ahead and run that survey. So who's out there? The fellas and those beautiful ladies that I call my cheerleaders. Who's out there thinking, waiting in expectation? Oh, Mr. Wonderful, what is he going to bring today? Is it is it one of those trickery videos that we see a lot on YouTube? A 30K pickup? Is that what you people are waiting for? <laughs> okay, calm down. So that means... You know I'm not going to give you any of that bullshit content. I'm always going to be up front. I'm always going to be real with you. This is no 30K pickup, but this is a, a freaking amazing pickup. Actually, minus the pants, this is basically an entire wardrobe pickup. So if you're here for an amazing unboxing, you're with, you're gonna, you want to witness Mr. Wonderful give you an amazing promo. And also... Do it in that 4K fashion. Then we'll go we'll go ahead and follow up with that survey at the very end. So, got a couple items right here. I got a couple items from eBay, and I got one item from a specific brand, and then also a shoe pickup from Goat. I don't really deal with Goat too much, but when I do pick up some items from there, very happy. So far, so good when it comes to those items. Right, if you see me looking to my right, actually, I'm on eBay now because I want to give this special person a shout out. And this is a perfect time where I could still leave feedback, so that's a great thing. So let's go ahead and go on to this first one. As you can see, an envelope right here, never been opened, but like I mentioned though before, when it comes to this item, when you actually see what item I'm about to, to unbox in front of you right now, you're gonna know okay I know I know where he's going with this one but you don't know all the you don't know the accessories that are gonna go with this fit you may know the pair of shoes but not the accessories okay so I have it open let me give this shout out to alfam underscore five three nine two so al a l fam f a m underscore five three nine two and he comes from that beautiful state of California and also that great city of Los Angeles right here. So let's take a look at this one. So his his actual real name, that was his eBay name, but his actual real name is Alfred Amaya. So let's go ahead and take a look at this item. Oh, so nicely, a nice bubble wrap envelope. Can't complain about that, but here we go. Let's take a look at this. So let me try to get this. So still in package. Yeah, he probably did open it, but, um, I mean, still brand new. Still got the tags, but you see that? The Stussy right there. Let's try to get a good, oh, look at that. Medium in that white. Not a big fan of white tees, but when it comes to certain ones, I do make a case to buy them. But brand new with tags, but you see that right there. Stussy. Nice, born, raised right here. Born and raised, eight ball tee great shirt so when it came to this tee i've seen it a, a while ago when it first released but i wasn't like too crazy about it but then the more i saw it i was like you know what that's a really cool tee i should probably add that to the to the wardrobe so i was like you know what let me go ahead and get that i'm gonna go ahead and grab that and of course you already know that's like a dead giveaway when it comes to this this unboxing this Floyd's pickup is where I'm going with this this one right here so you do have that nice hit though the eight ball born and raised Stussy on the very top you see that right there and then if you know what this shirt is you, there's gonna be a huge um, 
a huge kit when it comes to that same symbol right there, that same style, that same pattern in the back. It's going to be huge. So great right there. Can't wait to actually see that um, on me. And I can't wait to actually put that, put the whole entire outfit together. I don't need my X-Acto knife on this one. This is another gift that I was just, I couldn't wait to open when I, when it came in. And to, to be honest with you, this was the last one the last piece to this outfit that I was that I was actually waiting for um, great piece right here from what I see in it when it comes to this when it comes to this um this fit or this accessory it's gonna be an amazing piece so oh, look at that let me go let me go ahead and show you this so i never actually okay so when it comes to lv i'm going to give it away i never actually buy stuff online i always go to the store to check it out before i buy it just like this this piece right here um any of those wallets any of the wallets that I, actually the wallets were all gifts so appreciate that but when i purchase anything for somebody else or right here this item for myself i never purchased it online i always go to the store and pick it up but this one right here i couldn't find it anywhere to anywhere near me to go purchase this so i had to go online so this is the first time i actually ever bought something from lv online so let's take a look so it came in this just a traditional box but look at that inside that's a crazy inside look at that just in case you never experienced this. So this is probably where my receipt is. But look at that. Pretty cool. I like that. Let me go ahead and put this there. And I'm going to check this out. Because it looks like it. Oh, okay. It's a box within a box pretty much. Let me see. Oh, no. It's actually just one box. So that's a pretty cool design. Though. I like that. Really cool. Great presentation. But of course, when you spend the bucks... When it comes to items like this, you should get good presentation. You already know how disappointed I am when I do when I like when I purchased that YSL um, that card holder from Nordstrom. It wasn't from YSL directly, but from Nordstrom. You already know how it came back not so good. So yeah, this is all just like the receipts and stuff like that. I'm trying to get it. There you go. Um, so pretty cool on that. But yeah, I'm just not a not a fan of how Nordstrom sends it to me. It doesn't come like nearly as this, but like I mentioned though, this is from the actual store, so I would think it would be a lot better. So just in, it looks like they gave me a little envelope in case this is like a gift for somebody, but no, this is a gift for myself, so don't need that. But look at that. Nice little packaging right here. Let's take a look at this though. I'm excited for this. So when it comes to jewelry or accessory stuff like that, I'm not big on like flashy stuff. I'm not big on on anything that's just overwhelming to the human eye. I like it really simple. I like it really just basic when it comes to that. I kind of keep like my, when it comes to uh, my shoes are more like the, the flashiness of, of my fit. Cause that's just how shoes are so here we go but when it comes to my accessories i really don't like it too blinged out or anything like this so this is a really simple piece and this is going to go perfect with this right here let's take a look oops let me go ahead and stand up really quick checking out the games right now definitely wanted to see the games because it is a nice day to watch some football. Okay, so here we go. So there it is right there. So it's a nice, see that? You got the nice hits right there. You got the nice monogram in the black. That, that black. Um, yeah, so this right here, you could see. But it does have, oh, there you go. Perfect. So. What drew me to this is um, is the, what's it called, is the blue. That's what really drew me to that. So I love that blue color and then also the black. 
They came out with one a while back. I, I'm gonna definitely need to try this on, make sure it fits my wrist. But they came back. With, they came out with one way back when, and it was like it was same that nice blue, that indigo blue, but also came with um like a red hit and in, in brown. So that one I went to the store and I looked for that one. That was like freaking five years ago when that one came out. But nice piece, just a great piece for this this specific outfit i do wear a lot of blue so it's gonna just be amazing when it comes to any fit that i decide to wear sometimes i don't want to always wear a watch i don't always want to wear my tag so that's just going to be another great alternative go-to when it comes to like not wanting to wear like a watch or or just a, you know just a little simple um accessory that i can always go to because i like i said i do wear a lot of blue so this one right here, let me go ahead and change this on my eBay so I can give this person a shout out. So just a quick little background when it comes to this specific piece. So when I saw, I saw this a long time ago. I want to say this, I saw this hat like two years ago and I ordered it. I forgot from what I want to say street soul. I don't even know, but I know they no longer exist. But I actually ordered that red Kill the Hype hat. So I'm going to give it away. It is a Kill the Hype hat. So I ordered this one right here that I'm about to show you in particular. But they said, oh, they gave me a story, I guess, they got broken into. And they were waiting for this to come in. And it just never came in. Or it did come in and it got stolen. Whatever. But they gave me the option to either um, get my money back or get another one. So I picked that red one. Great hat. I wear that occasionally. Beautiful hat because that beautiful bright red. But I always wanted this hat. This one always like kind of haunted me because I really wanted this one to, for the collection. And then when I saw like that shirt and then I was like, you know what? That hat's going to go perfect with that. So then I got the hat. So this was another amazing accessory to go with this specific outfit right here. So this one comes from Looney Mart. L O O N E Y Mart M A R T, and he comes from the beautiful state of California, but also the city of Long Beach. So shout out to Lo to you, Looney Mart. Same exact on on the tag right here on the label, Looney Mart, Long Beach, California. So let's take a look at this one right here. Make sure I open it right. Let's go ahead and go. Right now. So let's go ahead and unbox this one so this was another piece that i still have time to leave um feedback for so i'm, I'm happy about that but like i said this was a hat that i really wanted from from way back when and i was really happy when i actually saw this because i never seen this one before i see a lot of different kill the hype hats but particular i never really see this one right here so I never see anybody even wearing it, so it's really cool knowing that definitely something that I don't have to see like a million other people wearing the same the same uh, same color, same brand. So it comes in this nice right here, kill the hype little bag right here. So nice little bag right there. See that? Kill the hype on there, Los Angeles, California. So let's take a look at that. I like that. I like oh, this is beautiful. Beautiful. Can't touch the white because I, I don't know how dirty my hands are from these packages, but look at that. Oh, gorgeous right here. Look at that nice red bill. Beautiful. Take that off. There, the nice white hat, that beautiful blue right there. Love that. I'm not a Dodger fan, but I, I can tolerate this right here. But it does have Dodgers on there. 2020. I that I highly I don't agree with that. That's an asterisk year when it comes to the World Series because of the playoffs. Where like no no fans were in the stadium, all that stuff. I'm not even gonna go into that. Beautiful kill the hype. L A hit in the back in that beautiful blue. Gorgeous hat though. Look at that. Um, it's gonna be hard to keep clean, but as you all know, I don't wear my hats very often. But beautiful hat. Look at that. Amazing. 
Oh, it's going to be amazing. And then that accessory on top of that. Oh, my God. Like I said, this is going to be an entire fit right here that I'm about to unbox in front of you. But amazing. Simply amazing. Let me go ahead and let some of this air out in this package. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So, I mean, I, can't, I definitely did it on this one. I mean, if you really want to do the breakdown of this, good luck. It's going to be a, this is a pretty pricey fit that I put together. Goat pickup right here. Let's go ahead and take a look at this one. You already know what where this one's going. This is no surprise. But all those accessories and that tee to go with this specific pair of shoes is just going to be amazing. Sometimes I surprise myself, I mean, about how I put this stuff together in my mind. But let's go ahead and take a look at this. All right, here we go. Look at that. The Nike SB box. Like I said, you already know where this one is going. Actually, so I had my eye on this shoe for a while. This was actually this. I actually got the shirt. I got the shirt first, the hat. Then I got the shoes. The shoes I wanted to really wait on because I wanted to get it at a good price. As you all know, this is one of those shoes that really shot up in price. And I'm not even going to say it's because of how great it is, but it's because the person behind the shoe passed away. Tragically, unexpectedly. So that really made the shoe spike up. This shoe I was not too crazy about. But after, like, once I got that shirt, I already knew. I was like, okay, I have to get the shoe because of the shirt. And just wouldn't be making, it wouldn't make any sense if I was wearing the shirt with, like, some other type of SB or any, some type of shoe. It only makes sense to wear it with, with this pair. So here we go. Let's take a look at that. Nike SB Dunk Low P Pro QR QS Deep Royal White Black Size 10 and a half. Like I said, this is from goat got that goat verification right there so let's take a look at this see this it's the first time i ever seen this in hand but here we go what do you think about this one sneaker of the year is this i mean what do you think looks great though looks great in hand materials look amazing the swoosh is definitely different you got like kind of like a holograph swoosh but I will definitely be doing my own review on this shoe. So great shoe. Like I said, I'm not like this wasn't like a shoe that I was like anticipating coming out. Actually, I was going to pass on this one. But once I got the, the shirt, once I got. Yeah, once I really got the shirt, I already knew. OK, I have to definitely go after. Go after this. This shoe, because it only makes sense that way. So. Great pickup on my part. What do you think about that shoe? What do you think about this fit? I mean, definitely doing it. Look at that. I mean, look at that. Beautiful. So, what do you think about this pickup? Especially before the holidays. Like I said, this these are all gifts for myself that I wanted to bless myself with. But these are items that I just had brewing in my mind as far as putting it all together. I feel like it's going to be an amazing outfit for when I do decide to bring it out. Especially that accessory. I can't wait to get that accessory in hand. The hat, you know, of course, that t-shirt. And then when I do decide to wear the shoes, I mean, I already have it all together. So, beautiful. But what, what, what else do you expect from Mr. Wonderful? Always bringing you greatness in front of the camera. Always bringing you greatness when it comes to my pickups. Not only just giving you random shoes. Not only just giving you just random items. But how I always bring it all together at the very end. When it comes to a fit. So in closing. Floyd on YouTube. Is just too. Sweet. And the survey just came in. One more. For the good guy. And you know what. Look at that. If you smell something. Yeah. That's us. Because we're the stuff. Tune in next time. Why? Why? Because I'm Floyd Chavez. Why? Because I'm Mr. Wonderful. Why? 
Because I created this fucking channel. Why? Because the sneaker game <laughs> is my bitch.